Hey everybody. Uh, I want to try to keep this video pretty short. Um, so today is 9-11-23, 22 years after 9-11 happened. And uh, <clears throat> I don't really want to make a video so uh, so much to remember 9-11 because anybody that was alive or old enough to remember 9-11 and even uh, some people that, that weren't even born yet know about 9-11. But uh, those of us that are old enough to remember when it happened... Uh, I would take a guess that it Im impacted us, you know, at a certain level. And the main purpose for this video is not only uh, in remembrance of 9-11, but also what 9-11 also did in the aftermath. Everybody started coming together. And, you know, even though it happened in New York, everybody started to come together because everybody, that was just like, a, it was like a huge slap in the face. Man, anything can happen at any time. And so, you know, because of that, um, people started coming together. People started uh, helping out in their community more. And, you know, started to think about their, their family a little bit more. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, all the things that we should be doing uh, anyway, regardless of a major tragedy like that or not. And, uh, especially the last few years, you know, it, seem, it looks like to me that most of us have gone back to how, how we, how a lot of us normally do. It's just, you have your day-to-day -day life, you need to get to work, you're in a hurry, you need to get your kids running late from work to go and pick your kids up, um, or any number of, of things, um, you know, because, because of our, our daily lives, not all, not all of us, but a lot of us, because of our daily lives, we become incon incon inconsiderate of other people. We don't need another national tragedy to occur in order for us to be considerate of other people. To, uh, if you're somebody that has the time and the ability to help out in your community, you should do that. Um, I mean... The main purpose in this video is I want everybody to remember that uh, on a certain level, every everybody is important. And, you know, just people need to get back to being respectful of others, being consider it if you see somebody that needs help help them uh you know it doesn't have to be some old granny or anything if somebody's broke down on the side of the road you know you want to be a little little careful with that but at the same time you know if you're able to help and you have the time at least offer to help and, you know, depending on what the situation is. And, uh, I don't know how many people this video is going to reach. 
because, I mean, let's be honest, I don't really have any subscribers. I think I might have a couple. Um, and the few the few videos that I have made really hasn't reached a, a ton of people. <clears throat> but uh, anyways, I'm just kind of sitting here waiting on my daughter to get out of school. And, uh, you know, with today being 9-11, uh, I've kind of been thinking about it throughout the day. Uh, I'm a delivery driver, so I'm by myself majority of the time uh, during my shift. And so, you know, I think about a lot of things. And with today being 9-11, um, I've been thinking about, to, you know, the anniversary of today quite a bit and I just wanted to put a video out basically you know reminding people to um, be like it was you know unfortunately it should be like it was after 9-11 happened and everybody was willing to help everybody didn't matter if you were in Texas uh, the, the didn't matter what state you're in, everybody had the same mindset of, oh man, you know, anything can happen. I might not see tomorrow. And, you know, especially if you have a family, you know, mom, dad, sister, kids, uh, you know, uh, there's a, there's a lot of people on 9-11-2001 that uh, went to work like any other day and uh, they never got to leave work so you know I hope that people I hope a lot of people see this video and you know not for me or anything because I'm not getting any, I'm not getting paid from these, from this video or, you know, anything. So, you know, just for, for the good of, of our society, um, I hope people see this video and, you know, remember to, um, you know, if you're not quite paying that much attention to, to your kids, pay a little bit more attention to them. If all you have is five minutes, that's better than none at all. Uh, you know, read them a book or, you know, if they're around five, you know, if, if they're younger, five years old, six years old, seven years old, get them to read you a book. Um, you know, or just ask how their day's going. Uh, if you haven't, you know, seen your parents or your grandparents in a while or any family members or even, you know, close friends, if you haven't talked to them in a while, I have a few friends that, um, I never see them, uh, you know, cause they work, I work, I, I have a life, they have a life. We're usually pretty busy people, but always make sure I have about three or four friends that even though we don't really see each other um, at, and, and it seems to work out usually if I'm thinking about calling them I'll either call them or why, you know I just happen to think of a particular person uh, they seem to call me within a couple of days and you know we'll talk on the phone for a while and uh, you know sometimes that's all it takes. And uh, so, yeah, uh, I hope after people watch this video, they just take away, you know, the, the fact that, you know, pay a little bit more attention to your, to your family, to your friends. Um, let them know that you, you care about them, that you love them. I'm not saying you got to, you know, tell your buddy that you love them, but, you know, hopefully you know what I mean. And, uh, 
yeah so definitely you know remember 9-11 but also remember to uh, not take things for granted because not not only could something happen to you and you could not be here tomorrow but something could happen you know with a friend or family member and uh, you know try your best not to uh, I mean you know yeah you, you're going to get upset with people people are going to get upset with you it happens you know people have disagreements but try your best to work it out and uh, you know worst case if y'all can't work it out then you know just try not to try not to uh, keep the negative energy and uh, agree to dis agree to disagree you know so I guess that's pretty much all I'm trying to say and this video is already longer than I expected it to be. But just, you know, be kind to your neighbors. Uh, you know, even when somebody does you wrong, that doesn't mean turn around and do them wrong. You know? And, you know, for the people that are Christian out there, um, ba you know, Baptist, Christian, Catholic for that matter, just because somebody does you wrong doesn't mean that you do them wrong. Because you, you should strive to be the bigger person. And, you know, if you have to stay away from that person, then stay away from them. You know, don't talk to them. Whatever. But if you respond in a negative way, what do you win? I mean, what, you know, by, by, by you going back and forth and, you know, arguing with somebody or fighting with somebody, what do either one of you win? Does it make either one of your, you know, does it make your life better? No, it doesn't. You know, and, you know, if you're somebody that works, you still have to go to work the next day. Just because you were, you know, didn't want to be the bigger person, doesn't mean you, have, you don't have things in your life that you have to deal with already. So, you know, why, why, why cause, cause yourself the stress? And, you know, if you're on bad terms with your kids or your parents or grandparents or, you know, whatever, and something happens to you, something happens to one of them, you'll never be able to live down the fact that you or that person left this earth on bad terms but you know but between the two of you and you're going to wish you could say you're sorry but then you can't because then it's too late so yeah I guess that's all I got for this video and uh, to all the, the families not only the people who perished during that tragedy, but all of the family members left behind. Prayers go out to them. And they've been, you know, I've, I've been thinking about them throughout the day. And uh, so I guess that's all I got for this video. And I hope everybody has a good rest of your day. Thank you for watching.